In this example, I need to find the exact value of the cosine of negative 5 pi divided by 6. Notice it says exact value, so that means don't use your calculator as it will give you an approximate solution. I need to use the unit circle shown over here. But is the angle negative 5 pi over 6 on my unit circle? No, all the angles on the unit circle are positive angles. So there's two ways to do this problem. I'm going to show you both ways and then you can pick the method you prefer. The first method uses the fact that the cosine function is an even function. What do we mean by that? A function f is an even function if f of negative x equals f of x for all x in the domain of f. So knowing that the cosine function is an even function, we can say the cosine of negative 5 pi divided by 6 equals the cosine of positive 5 pi divided by 6. And is 5 pi over 6 on the unit circle? Yes, it is right here. And remember, for points on the unit circle, the x coordinate is the cosine of that angle, the y coordinate is the sine of that angle. I'm looking for the cosine of 5 pi over 6, so it's the x coordinate of this point. So it is negative the square root of 3 over 2. So the cosine of negative 5 pi over 6 is negative the square root of 3 over 2. The second method I'm going to use to solve this problem involves coterminal angles. So take your given angle of negative 5 pi divided by 6 and add one revolution, which since we're in radians is 2 pi. Turn it into a fraction by dividing it by 1. I need a common denominator, so multiply by 6 over 6. And I get negative 5 pi divided by 6 plus 2 times 6 is 12 pi divided by 6. Negative 5 plus 12 is positive 7 pi over 6. Now is 7 pi over 6 on the unit circle? Yes, it is right here. Remember 7 pi over 6 is if I rotate in a positive direction like that, but negative 5 pi over 6 would be this angle here. So now I know that the cosine of negative 5 pi over 6 equals the cosine of its coterminal angle of 7 pi over 6. And what is the x-coordinate of this point? It is negative the square root of 3 over 2. So the cosine of negative 5 pi over 6 is negative the square root of 3 over 2. Did I get the same answer in both cases? Yes. It's totally up to you which method you prefer to use.